Hey, City of 2013. Hopefully everybody's having a great day. Um, yeah, just basically wanted to share with you um, the new filter I got for this 125 African uh, Cichlid Aquarium. I did have an Eheim 2028 on here, um, but because I had to set up a tank for Goldie, my Asian Arowana, I used that filter and I transferred it over to that aquarium. So that means I need to get a filter for this 125. And after many years of Eheim and um, many years of reviewing which filter would be the best suited and which would be the best for bang of the buck anyways, um, I decided on the Fluval FX6. As you can see, That is exactly what I decided to get. So yeah, this is what is pretty much filtering the 125 at the moment. Plus I do have the uh, ActClear uh, 110 <clears throat> also. I removed one of them. I did have two, but I figured um, with uh, the FX6 which filters um, up to 400 gallons which should suffice and uh, well so far it's actually doing the job so I mean it uh, it's pretty good um, better than I expected actually so thumbs up to uh, Fluval for that Let's give you a side shot as to how it looks. Yeah, so this is the Fluval FX6. You pretty much see all the way through. This is a six foot tank. So yeah, once again, I am now filtering this 125 with an FX6, and uh, one AquaClear 110, which really I don't really need, but since I already have it, I, uh, I'm using it just for uh, extra filtration. Um, it was an easy to set up. It was, um, you know, uh, pretty much, uh, you know, explained it in the manual. Um, if you ever need help, lots of uh, YouTube uh, videos on how to set one up and uh, what kind of media you can put inside the trays. Um, it pretty much came with everything. So, you know, that's a plus and yeah quite happy with it at the moment um, not much noise at all so you know very happy um, and that's what's good about uh, you know reviews on YouTube and just other um, sites uh, with you know African slick cichlids and fluval um, filters and what have you not definitely if you ever need to get anything any equipment um, do read up on it first read the reviews and uh, decide then on your own to see what uh, 
is best for you and uh, you know budget wise and what have you not but um, yeah that's pretty much it just wanted to share with you what's filtering this bad boy and uh, yeah have yourself a good one guys girls cheers